Alright, so today we're going to make a spoil board or a sacrificial board for our Chinese 1610 or equivalent CNC milling machine. Spoil boards are useful when you need to mill all the way down and you don't want to hit the aluminum bed in this case. This is just a random piece of plywood but it happened to fit perfectly so first we'll cut out a piece with the right dimensions. In Fusion 360, I'm just going to go with an extremely general approach with a grid of counterboard holes which fit the bed of my machine. You might want to do something different. Now for the milling. We'll first set up the stock. Then we're going with a 2D facing operation, but first we have to define our tool. Always check your heights. Yeah, I selected the wrong tool shape. We need a flat end mill. There's the face. Now we need a pocket operation for all the holes. Great! The only problem is that it's going to take way too long. This is caused by the ramping function. So we'll lower the height and increase the angle. We'll switch back to our design and add a bit of a draft on our holes, which will improve the machining and then we regenerate the operations. Finally, we'll print a full-scale view on paper, because it makes it easier to go from the virtual world to the real world. Secure the board on the bed. We set our origin point. Remember to check all the tool movements. It might collide with something. And now we can finally start milling.
We want to make the bottom perfectly flat. Now we can use screws to mount the spoil board to our bed. Wait, let's play with the laser for a bit. Safety first though. Test on low power mode, then we'll let it burn. Here's what it looks like with the glasses on. Now we'll finish facing off the spoil board. And there we go! Like and subscribe for more videos!